Well, you said that when you're so totally risky. Can you tell me about what the riskiest moment that we had together, you and I, today? Was there something, some particular moment that you felt? I don't know. I don't know if I've thought about it that way. Okay. I think um, maybe what I, uh, maybe what it is for me, it's more about like understanding, like mm -hmm. being understood mm -hmm. more than like taking a risk of exposure. It's more like. Um, Was there something that you felt understood by me and something maybe. Well, the fact that you picked up on the aspirations of of acting in that kind of energy of high school i feel that's really central like we would it's be and amazing that you would we, find that in yes. such a short time because i feel like um that's something that i've thought about but never really mm -hmm. i mean sure i've done a little bit of exploration on it but yeah. i think that's true i make a concerted effort to check in during every session about how things are going between myself and the client. I refer to that as a here and now focus. I want to pay close attention to the relationship process between the therapist and the client. In that way, the therapeutic relationship becomes a place for the client to learn how he or she is in other relationships. Most relationships People do not talk explicitly about how the relationship is going. So the therapist must actively and repeatedly ask about this. It's also a way for the therapist to get feedback and make sure we're moving in the right direction. Well, that, that, that question you're raising, are you living fully? What, what's the answer you, you come up with? I mean, there's... What would living fully be? Uh, how would that be different from what your life is now? I think there's two aspects to that that immediately come to mind. That, like, if I were the only one, in my, if I wasn't married with yeah. children, right. I would be living a much different life, as I said last session. I would be living somewhere in the developing world, working in global health. Um, you gave a very contemplative look then. You stopped for a minute. If I were not married and having children, you, your eyes went up and there was that moment. That what, what happened just that second? The thought of not being married or having children. <laughs> Did you catch that at all? Didn't notice it? Or? Um, it was a moment of clarity, perhaps. I mean, a moment of like... <laughs> <laughs> right. A moment of uh, of imagining, perhaps, like uh, what would it be like? Yeah. There's some part of it, me, that would that would be very nice. Yeah. A small part because my family brings so much joy to me, but um And so it's a tether, it's a um It's a tether. I've made choices yeah. that I mm -hmm. am living with around sacrifices around where I live and how I'm living. Mm -hmm.